You have one final frontier yet to come. Isa, Evan, Santiago, good morning. Good morning. Good morning. How are you? I'm doing great. Thanks for telling me about uh, season two for Picard. I'm three episodes in. Woo, seatbelts. I mean, mm -hmm. uh, I'm a big Star Trek fan. So, man, congratulations so far on season two. Just excellent so far. Thank you. Uh, San Diego, uh, Santiago, the crew of the Star guys are finding themselves in a different Earth reality. You know, they have a fascist regime they're dealing with, danger at every turn. Doesn't Star Trek and science fiction do so does such a great job in using an allegory about showing what could happen in our own lives? It does. It definitely sort of is is a mirror to our own reality. That's why I love about science fiction that you know behind all the the spaceships and the and the dress up and aliens and different worlds, you're really just a reflection of our reality today. So, and we had the advantage this season of actually traveling back to today as well and taking that even further and and you know really taking a step back and looking at what's going on in the world. So, um, so for sure, I, I love that allegory and, and it's, you know, it's something that it's, you watch it and it doesn't seem like such a far away thing. It's kind of very prevalent and very present today. So I think it's, it's, it's good storytelling and it's, you know, obviously researched and based on, on facts. So there's, there's, um, there's a greater opportunity there to make you really reflect and kind of, uh, pay attention to, to, uh, what we're living through. And Evan, Elnor first, Romulan cadet, graduating from Starfleet Academy. Uh, tell me about your big fight scene with the guards of the fastest confederation. I mean, you you were swinging some hands there. I was, that was all me. And um, I gotta say that plate of glass that he flies through is very real. Um, I remember accidentally hitting a few people unintentionally. And I remember getting hit myself actually and seeing stars at one point, but I mean, Guy Fernandez, the head of stunts, um, the one who was coordinating everything, such a professional. And it was just amazing that he was able to have that much trust and like faith in my ability. And it looks so cool. And Issa, tell us about your characters this season. What can we expect for season two? Yeah, I think uh, when, when season two picks up, we're seeing um, obviously a lot of time has passed and um, everyone's kind of found different jobs that they're settling into. And uh, for Soji, she is kind of working as this, this um, traveling <laughs> diplomat, kind of going to different, uh, different planets, talking to different people, different heads of, of different cultures and, and being this, um, trying to bridge that gap that has been there for a long time of this fear of synthetics and, and fear of the unknown. And she's kind of going to them and showing like, we are not a threat. We are not dangerous to you. We just want to be accepted and uh, just want to live harmoniously <laughs> and, um, and showing what life could be like if we just accepted each other. Absolutely. Great message. And Santiago, actors love props. And I love how, your, how Rios has a cigar all the time, you know. So as a Star Trek fan, I have to know, is there a specific brand that he smokes? Or never smokes, I should say. <laughs> uh, yeah, I like to. I like to think that Cuban cigars. You know, I think uh, the prop master on set, uh, he, he tries as much as he can. But uh, but uh, yeah, the main thing is that they're moist, and you know, cigars are all about the texture. Really, they've got to be like out of a humidor. So he always brings them like with a great, you know, the the, the texture of them. They're very moist and, and and fresh. So that's good. And I, I bite them so hard that by the end of it, I need to. After a few takes, I've got to get a new one because the tips is just getting destroyed yeah well congratulations on season two of Picard streaming on Paramount Plus I understand you're underway for season three so let's talk again soon thank you so much thank you thank, thank you. you so much have a good one